quiet, peaceful, proudly reflecting on my history of drivers and their machines. It was the Emmy and Golden Globe award-winning actor Kiefer Sutherland who provided the voice of the Indianapolis Motor Speedway for us. Kiefer's at the racetrack here in Pocono today. Thanks for joining us. I know when somebody said to you, okay, we want you to play the voice of a speedway, <laughs> you probably said, what? Well, actually, in, in all fairness, I've done a lot of voiceovers for NASCAR, uh, for ESPN, and I uh, had the pleasure of doing the IMAX. Uh, which dealt with the history of NASCAR from the beginning uh, to today, and it's been a real pleasure uh, and informative as well. Yeah. Keith, for the new movie that you're starring in is actually a sponsored race car, J.J. Yaley's car out here. Why don't you tell us about the movie a little bit? Well, the irony of it, I just walked out and checked out the car, and it's um, the poster for the car is a very frightening uh, look at uh, a woman who is kind of being pulled apart, and in the back it says mirrors. Uh, and hopefully it'll be the last thing you want to see in your mirror as it's passing. <laughs> so, uh, I thought it was apropos for the for the track. Well, it's great you got your new movie out, but I'm gonna. I'm a 24 junkie. What is going on with Jack Bauer, man? Give me some inside scoop. We, we've been working away. Um, unfortunately, we got a little derailed uh, with the writer's strike and everything else that held everything up. Um, but we start in November with a two-hour prequel that we shot in Africa, which we're very proud about. And uh, the series starts in January. So. He's a bad dude. Jack Bauer's a bad dude. Boy. There you go. <laughs> now, now, you were hanging out with the J.J. Ellis race team earlier. Yeah. That, uh, that, yeah. Uh, the movie name is on the side of the car. You're going to get to meet every one of the drivers at introductions here shortly. And then you get to say the famous words, right? Start your engine. Yeah, oh, that's, that's awesome. That's got to be that's great. Awesome. Now, you've been around NASCAR racing a lot. As you, you talked about, you've done a lot of commercial work around mm -hmm. the sport. This sport that strikes you. Well, I think it, it was really born out of a natural competitiveness. Uh, it was not a league or a sport that was born out of an effort to make money or anything else. These were guys that raced in their hometowns and, and on dirt tracks around the country and ultimately went down to Daytona and raced on the beach. Uh, they made their own cars, and it evolved out of that. And there, there's something innately American yeah. uh, about NASCAR that, that I really couldn't say about any other sport. Uh, obviously, baseball and football are are, are pastimes, but uh, there's something special about NASCAR. Uh, it is born out of uh, just this this fuel that I think yeah. America has. Yeah, it's uh, it's Very it's. Well. Uh, I heard the saying used many years, many times. I think it was Ken Squire that coined it: "Ordinary men doing extraordinary yeah, things." things. Yeah. Perfect, and yeah. uh, and that describes NASCAR. No, we got to get you over to the introduction stand so you can meet all those drivers. Mirrors opens August uh, 15th. It's a sponsor of JJ Ailey's car today. And thank you for being the extraordinary oh, yeah. voice of the Indianapolis Absolutely. Motor Speedway awesome. for us heart. last week. Uh, thank you. Couldn't have been better. Sure, what a great race it was, too, eh? Yes, Absolutely. it was. After, 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 after At the after end, after. it was. Yeah. 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 Keeper Sutherland with us tonight, uh, today here at Pocono. And uh, he mentioned baseball, so it's time.